Yeah. Got any show for y'all. Got a damn good show, Keith. All right, so damn we, good show. Damn good show. So we had another UFC fight. Trump lo- loves the UFC, man. Well, he's good friends with that uh, that Bud Light lover. What's his name? Dana White. I heard he's good friends. <laughs> if I ever hear about my friend as being a, a Bud Light cranny piss supporter, it's over. Yeah. Hey, hey, we no longer friends. Hey, we had a good run, but I got to cut you loose. <laughs> You're bad for my brain. <laughs> right? I can't be seen in public with a trainee piss sympathizer. <laughs> so it's been fun, but you messed up. I'm time to become president. You, know what, you can sell that trainee piss to all your customers <laughs> you want, but not when I'm in the state. I've, you know what? Trump helped build that um, brand. But I had to change your heart when it comes to the Bud Light. You had to change your heart? Yeah. What are you talking about? I was just change? joking with Dana White. Like um oh you just joking with yeah because I don't think UFC is gonna save that brand he just took that money and said yeah I'm gonna make sure I kill you you see what I'm saying yeah yeah because that's a conservative brand that's diabolical man that's what I'm well, thinking it makes sense because he don't pay his fighters where's a hundred million dollars you didn't get that joke I just said a joke and it went right over your head what I said it makes sense because he don't pay his, his fighters shit but uh well that's true yeah, it makes sense. Just a horrible person, I guess. <laughs> Training piss sympathizer. He don't pay his fighters shit. Yeah, how much would it be to pay each fighter an extra six hundred thousand dollars? Hey, Kevin. It's nothing. No, it's, it's nada. Here we go, Kevin. It's going woke. Paquito. It's nada. <laughs> no, you're going woke. It depends on how, how much. No, 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 no. How no, much no. butts no, no, you put no. in the seats? No, 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 no. Yeah, it depends on how many butts you put in the seats. But hey, there's people fighting before the main event. They're entertaining people too. You yeah. should pay them accordingly. Uh, like what, uh, an extra fifty thousand or something. No man, an extra keep an extra three hundred thousand per fighter is nothing. Easy for you to say. We pay, you ain't but you ain't cutting the checks. We pay our employees better than he pays fighters. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's a fact. But anyway, back to what. We I really mean, want to I, talk about. I, I, hey, I'm not talking about this no more. I'm talking about Trump. I'm <laughs> dumb over Dana White. Net, damn, training, piss, sympathizing, drinking, traitor. <laughs> no, no real conservative <laughs> would sell that training <laughs> piss. <laughs> but anyway, so Trump comes in, and you know, Trump comes in. He came in with Tucker Carlson. It was a, it was a, it was a, it was a grand entrance. I mean, he's Trump. And then you got Tucker Carlson. These are they 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 they, they top not celebrities, man. Everybody yeah. knows Tucker Carlson. Everybody knows Donald Trump. Everybody. Trump is the most famous person in the world, I think. Oh, most definitely. Yeah. Didn't did not make one three at the buzzer. Everybody knows Trump. We went to Australia. We in the cab. What they talking about? Trump. He said, "What do y'all think about Trump?" I said, "Man, he's a damn good man." You know what that dude said? Get out of my taxi. <laughs> <laughs> He say that. Look like he hurt his feelings, though. <laughs> but anyway, Trump walks in. Yeah. Bill Burr's there. I mean, there's a lot of celebrities there. And Bill hey, Burr's Bill there. Bill Burr's big time. He's one of the top comedians around, right? He's one of the top media comedians in history. He's big time. He's I think big he's, time. he's hella funny, too. Yeah, he's hella funny. He's big time. I would even argue that he's funnier than Kevin. The tiny guy. Hart. I mean, Kevin's funny. But that Bill Burr. No, Bill Burr is easily top, I don't know, top five, top three, top, top two. Top five, that's disrespect. Put some respect on that white man's name. He's white, too? You need to give him more respect than that. Yeah, shut up. Anyway, Bill Burr's down. What do you say, top two? First is, well, Dave. All I know is he's hella funny, Kevin. I say. Hey, man, what we doing here? I'm not trying to come up with the top five comedians. <laughs> he's hella funny. Yeah, he's right? funny. Yeah. Matter of fact, they need well, whatever. <laughs> so Bill Burr's there, right? Trump and his and his crew walks in front, right? That Bill Burr sitting down. Bill Burr looks uncomfortable. He's like, man, what's all these white supremacists here for? <laughs> he he didn't look uncomfortable. He looked he looking at Trump like he was like he was some kind of terrorist. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, he was just sitting there. Well, he was looking at Trump like, what are you standing here for? <laughs> well, and uh. Bill Burr, his wife is there, and if you didn't his know, his wife is a colored woman. She's black. She's colored. So, here, check out the video. See, her holding up her middle fingers. Yeah. Look at her. She looking. I mean, 
Look at Bill Burr. He's like, oh my God. You can't get black people anything. <laughs> I mean, I don't get why. Look at all the people. There's one black person. Look what they do. <laughs> one black person in the whole picture. Look what they, how they acted. <laughs> The black man, the black woman, has been a has did a disservice to America. <laughs> Shut up. They just did a disservice right there on TV. A disservice. You got the 45th president of the United States and you pull up your middle fingers, you a disgrace to our great community, to our great nation. <laughs> why would you do that? If I was behind well, Joe see, Biden, AOC, I would never do that. You know why? Because I'm a mature human being. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody that behaves like it is immature. Yeah, I wouldn't do that to Biden. I wouldn't do that. Why would, would you do, do? Why would you do that? Period. Because you disagree with somebody's politics. You had a fight. You no, know it's not that. She, you know what? She's fell for the media's um, narrative that, that they pushed on Trump. She probably thinks he's a white supremacist. Well, the jokes on her because he's not. <clears throat> you know what? I, I'm pretty popular. We both are. We have a a, a, a pretty good brand. I had a. I sat down with my wife. And I said, hey, baby, you know who I am, right? Yeah, I'm somebody. I'm somebody popular. Don't do anything stupid. I had that talk with my wife. Looks Before like going Bill, out, right? Yeah, it looked like Bill Burr didn't have that talk with his wife. Uh, that is if my wife was black, that is the first thing I would do. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, baby, hey, you, who am I? That's right, Bill Burr. Bill Burr, I'm the Burr. I'm the Burr. I'm the Burr. I'm, I'm the shit. I'm one of the best comedians around this bitch. Yeah. So guess what? You better not do nothing stupid when you're around me. I mean, you put a lot of you make you put him in a rough spot. His wife. Well, I don't think politically. I don't think he. Um, I don't know what way he leans, but he's got common sense. He's got to have common sense. Yeah, his wife doesn't. <laughs> well, she's probably got common sense. She's just emotional. In black. <laughs> I think if you're emotional black, you should get a disability check. No, but seriously, like... You didn't get that joke? What? <laughs> being black and, and being emotional, you should get a disability <laughs> check. Well, just the thing. If y'all didn't know, I'm sure y'all already know. I would say over 93% of black people vote Democrat. Wow, Captain Obvious. No, we didn't know that. So it's, it's a different culture. It's a different... Did you call that culture? Vote 90% Democrat? <laughs> I mean, it's just That's a different... That's culture. That's being brainwashed. I'm just talking about black people. It's a... It's a... It's a... Um, it's, a it's an odd culture. <laughs> what I'm saying. Yeah. We're also the brokest culture in America. You could say we're the most ignorant culture, too. She proved it. Do you see Chinese people acting like that? Do you see Japanese people acting like that? Hell, do you see Aborigines acting like that? <laughs> I mean, what she did was, is how a child. No, it was. Shut up. The, that little. Hey, man, what you spit it out if you're going to say it? It was childish. Yeah. She's behaving like a child. Yeah, she's an adult. And she has a, a, a husband that's, you know, he hasn't went political in his comedies. Any of his comedy. Well, he comes pretty close, but he never walks. Well, he's obviously not a fan. I wouldn't say that. No, I know. If I know one thing about black women, a black woman would not stay with a Republican voting man if they're a uh, Democrat. Yeah. Well, There's who no knows, way man? They might be both Republicans. She just don't like Trump. Man, you crazy as hell. <laughs> <laughs> She's Republican. Yeah, she might want to be in one of those liberal Republicans like Bush. She's probably a Dick Cheney fan. She's probably down with the Cheneys. And that I'm, other girl, that other woman that got kicked out of office, his daughter, what's her name? Well, she's not in port. I, I no, can't but when her she, name. after she stuck her middle fingers up, she did it quick and did like this, like nobody saw me. Really? Yeah. Everywhere Trump goes, there's a camera on him. Did you see? She's like, yeah, I got away with it. Yeah, like nobody saw it. <laughs> <laughs> Being some people saw it. There's a camera right there, and you're flipping off the president. The 45th. She wasn't flipping off the camera. Uh -oh. She was flipping off the president. <laughs> she died How straight. delusional is people all, man? I mean, it looked like it would, it would open many people's eyes. This dude's being perse persecuted for just having a different He's opinion. being treated like what black people claim they are being treated in this country. Yeah, someone like like a black woman, you should, I don't know. Knowing this country's checking past with black people and how they were persecuted and mistreated, 
and now you see the president and you former, former president, president being persecuted, look like you would kind of sympathize with somebody like it. No, you know, you you give two middle fingers. It's just ignorance and stupidity and immaturity too. Yeah. I mean, a grown woman. You think Bill Burr camera. said, I bet you Bill Burr didn't even know she did it. He gets home, or maybe it's his phone's blown up. Hey, your wife just flipped up. Oh, this fucking black bitch. <laughs> Show. Swan date black women to come with baggage. Hey, hey, our giveaway is almost up. We give away a Ford Bronco, and it's no ordinary Ford Bronco. It's got 30,000 upgrades. It's a show truck in Vegas. And when you win the truck, yeah. you win 10,000 in cash. Stay in the win. Yeah. Go to officialhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site gets you automatically in the win. Yeah.